Hey everybody, it's Samantha Nicole Toys here, and today I'm going to be doing a small Dollar Tree haul. I didn't get too many things, um, because, I don't know, I, there was a couple things I wish I would have gotten, like some little miniature, like, kitchen utensil things for my American Girl dolls, but I decided to pass on those, which was kind of stupid on my part, but... Oh well, they might have them there the next time I go, which will probably be like next month or something. <laughs> so, yeah. So, as I said, I didn't get very much, but, um, don't judge me on this, <laughs> but I got this Mother's Day card for my mom at Dollar Tree. I know Mother's Day is still like... A month away but I always find that like I never end up getting her anything for Mother's Day because I forget until like a couple days before Mother's Day and then the night before Mother's Day I just throw together some cheap card you know that I make out of like lined paper and markers so I got her this card um, it's originally three dollars and eighty nine cents so you know it's not, like, a cheap card or anything. I just got it for cheap. And then I also got my mom this logic puzzle because, I don't know, she likes Sudoku puzzles and stuff like that, so I figured she would like this. Um, yeah, I think I saw this in somebody else's haul, so I was excited to find that. And then I also got this for my mom for Mother's Day because I figured I was going to get her, like, just one of those, like, gift bags, you know, except I decided this would be better because it's like an actual like reusable bag so like she can reuse it and she's always using bags like this anyways so yeah I figured that would be a good thing to get her and that's just like dirt and just dis a dish a discoloration basically so it's not that disgusting it's just a discoloration then I got these popcorn buckets. There's two of them, so basically 50 cents a piece. I got this to do blind bag videos with, like put blind bags in there like how I do with my fish tank, which I just haven't gotten any blind bags lately, which I could have yesterday, but I just decided not to. I don't know why. I just didn't want to. And then I got this wrapping paper. And I really like it because it has ice creams, and there's my favorite, mint chip. Um, I got this so I can have it as, like, a background for my videos. So basically, almost, I'm assuming almost every single video after this one should have this uh, background so that you don't see just, like, this weird window. You just see um, this ice cream wrapping paper. Um, yeah, and I mean... It might not be just the ice cream wrapping paper. I might buy some other wrapping papers too and switch out backgrounds so it's not always like the same because that gets boring after a while. And then one of my favorite things, I saw this in somebody else's haul. I want to say it was, I th think it's Cheap Crafty Girl. Is that her username? I think it is because she like goes to the Dollar Tree a lot and so I really like her videos and she does like pocket letters and stuff. <laughs> So I have pen slash stylo, which I'm assuming stylo means pen in a different language. And then it has black ink. And it just looks like this. And I think I'm going to take this out of the packaging and try it real quick. Okay, so here we go. Let's see. So this is pretty cute. I like this. This is, it's kind of weird because you're, this just, it's kind of weird, but it's really cute. Yep, it writes in black ink. Um, yeah, I'm not very good at cursive. But, yeah, so... This pen, I definitely recommend this. If you like dogs and you think this is a cute pen, definitely get it because it obviously works. I just showed it to you that it works. And then I got this puzzle... And it's currently all, like, ripped open because I opened it so that I could build the puzzle. I haven't really finished it yet. 
because I'm assuming a few pieces, the reason it was at Dollar Tree is because a few of the pieces were like missing, like it was a recall puzzle, if you know what I mean. If you don't know what that means, just ask me in the comments down below and I will definitely tell you there. Um, so basically like it's just, it, I don't know. I think it has all the pieces. It's really cute though. And it says like free cupcake recipe inside. Here's the recipe. Cinnamon jelly donut cupcakes. I don't know about you, but I think this is disgusting. Like I think that would be terrible. I mean, jelly donut cupcakes would be good. Cinnamon donut cupcakes would be good. But not cinnamon jelly donut cupcakes. Like, who makes those? And look how many ingredients. That's a lot of ingredients. Like, I guess. When you pay, when it's, like, free, it doesn't matter. So, yeah. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you think this is disgusting and you hate this and then make sure to give this a thumbs up if you would try this or you would want to try this personally I think I would want to try this just because I'm so curious about what would this taste like I mean cinnamon jelly donut cupcakes I don't know I mean I guess I could make them and just not put the cinnamon because cinnamon and jelly I don't maybe in I don't know Maybe in some other country that's, like, a thing that you eat together, but, yeah, I don't really just, yeah. So, basically, if you get this puzzle, don't expect to have a good uh, recipe with it. And they had a bunch of other really cute ones, and I'm surprised. The packaging, or the puzzle pieces, are really good quality, so I definitely recommend all of these products, I think. Um, yeah. So, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye!